Mambo vipi mtazamaji wa Wangu 5 TV kama unavyoweza kushuhudia mabingwa wa ligi kuu soka Tanzania bara tunawazungumzia miamba ya soka eh, ya uh, Tanzania lakini Afrika kwa jumla Simba Sports Club ikiwa tayari wametua uh, uwanja wa ndege hapa jijini Dar es Salaam na uh, wapo tayari kujiandaa na mchezo wao dhidi ya Azam FC katika kombe la FA lakini tayari wameshatawazwa kwa mabingwa hawa mpaka hivi sasa kwa sababu uh, jumla ya pointo hizo nazo hakuna klabu yote e, inaoshiriki ligi kuu soka Tanzania bara ambayo inaweza kufikia idadi ya pointi ambazo mnyama Simba amezikusanya hapo jana kama ulivyoweza kushuhudia katika mchezo wa jana Simba waliweza kutoa sare ya tasa ya sifuri bin sifuri dhidi ya Tanzania Prisons na matokeo hayo yakaifanya Simba kuweza e, kufikisha jumla alama hizo tisa ambazo ni vigumu kwa klabu yote kufikia na hivyo kutawazwa kwa mabingwa rasmi tunasubiri muda ukifika e, ili kuweza kukabidhiwa kombe lao la Adam Sports Federation Cup. I think your first question could be congratulations for the league. Yes, yes, yes. yes. I think that's your first uh, question to or to to tell me. The plan for Azam first uh, we just came back. So there is no plan yet. And uh, there's first recovery. I think the guys uh, deserved yesterday evening a uh, couple of hours to to relax and to to enjoy the moment of taking the title. Uh, in the afternoon it's recovery. Tomorrow we will train and everyone is fit. So that's good. And tomorrow we will think from in from the morning when we wake up, we will think for the cup and we will think which team we can play, how we will play and uh, so on. After winning the championship of Tanzania, are you going to change uh, or to rotate the squad toward the last game, six games in the VPL? I think you have to distinguish two things. Uh, when we started after Corona, we had 15 or 17 points ahead, so you can take uh, rotation easier than in the cup. In the cup, it's winning or losing. You go through or you're out. So I think in the cup, uh, and it's not thinking, in the cup you play with your strongest team. Coach, uh, you have African Cup. That's next year. First we have uh, Azam and the cup, all African continent games, that's for uh, September, October. We don't think about that, we think about Azam and that's in two days. All the rest is future and it's dreaming. Also, it's your fifth time in this championship. Maybe you can, you can explain us your experience. How was it? The league, you mean? The league? Um, I must say when I came here uh, and I saw the first games I was surprised because the technical abilities are quite good. Um, the tempo is not too high if you compare it to S South Africa or the, the Northern African competitions. But technically and tactically it's not bad, it's in a good level. So uh, I was positively, positively surprised uh, for the league and I think even we can make more steps uh, to develop Tanzanian football, not only me, but also the national team and all the teams around, facilities. Uh, we can grow, there's a lot of uh, things to do, so even in the future for Tanzania, I think it's, it can be bright if we make the right uh, decisions or the, the people in charge take good decisions to develop facilities and football and grassroots. Coach, uh, third title for Simba frequently, what do you mean for you? First is second, uh, Simba we promise to take 10 titles. Do you think we have a team to, uh, to score 10 titles? Not frequently? promise, target. Yes. Uh, there are two things. Uh, there's the short-term vision and the long-term vision. Um, if you ask me, you have a team to, to win 10 titles in a row? 
then I say no because some guys are 30 years old. If we win 10, they're 40 years old. So in the end, you always make in the end of a season uh, an evaluation of the squad and you see what you need and what you don't need anymore. So actually we cannot predict what you have in 10 years. So that's impossible. But uh, the squad is good enough to, to continue. Um, Three titles in a row, that means that Simba in the, past, in the last three years are dominant. And I think when you have a dominant position, you don't stand still. Even when you're dominant, you have to make steps forward to stay dominant and to stay on top of the league for the next couple of years. And that's the two things you have to don't mix up, but really uh, guide the process that uh, even the short term targets, we can get them and the long term targets. That's something for the CEO and other people to, to guide that through the process. Frequent title for you, what do you mean? Sorry? Frequent. Uh, Frequent? Uh, yes, title, three title. For you, what do you mean? Of course, the end of the history of Simba. Actually, for me personally, uh, it's not that important because it's my first one. But if you look to the club's history, then I think it's very important. Not many clubs win three titles in a row, not even two in a row. So uh, that's one. But I think we have this year one big target and 2020 can be a good year to be our first double and cup and league and I think that's your short-term uh, target we have to aim this season. Thank you.